Have you ever wondered about a time when Earth's climate suddenly changed, plunging parts of the world into a mini ice age? Let's rewind to roughly 12,900 years ago, to a period known as the Younger Dryas. This was a time when our planet experienced a dramatic and abrupt climate shift. After a period of warming following the last ice age, temperatures dropped sharply, especially in the Northern Hemisphere. This rapid cooling lasted for about 1,200 years, creating a blip in Earth's climatic history. The Younger Dryas is more than just a historical curiosity, though. It's a significant chapter in the story of our planet, offering key insights into the complexities of Earth's climate system. This was the Younger Dryas, a fascinating period that we're going to delve into today. The Younger Dryas took place around 12,900 to 11,700 years ago. This period was a sharp detour in Earth's climatic journey, as our planet was emerging from the last ice age. Suddenly temperatures dropped and the world was thrust back into a mini ice age. But what evidence do we have of this dramatic shift? It's etched into the geological record. Layers of sediment, ice cores and fossilized pollen tell a story of abrupt change. Beneath the Earth's surface, we find signs of colder climates and altered ecosystems. This evidence paints a vivid picture of the Younger Dryas as a time of significant climatic upheaval, with implications for life on Earth. The Younger Dryas is best known for its abrupt climate changes. Picture a world suddenly plunged into a deep chill almost overnight on a geological timescale. The average global temperature dropped by about 6 degrees Celsius, a drastic shift that would be akin to the current average temperature of the Earth dropping to match that of Antarctica today. This rapid cooling was no slow crawl into winter, but a headlong plunge into an icy abyss. It was a shock to the system of our planet, causing an upheaval in global ecosystems. Plants, animals and humans were all forced to adapt to this new frigid world. The severity of these changes had profound effects on the planet's ecosystems. The Younger Dryas also coincided with significant cultural and biological shifts. Notably, this period marks the decline of the Clovis culture, a prehistoric Paleo-American culture known for their distinctive stone tools. As the climate cooled, these hunter-gatherers faced new challenges. Their prey, the megafauna, also suffered. Mammoths, mastodons and saber-toothed cats, among others, found it increasingly difficult to find food and shelter. This led to a massive extinction event, wiping out a majority of these magnificent beasts. As the megafauna dwindled, so did the Clovis, their way of life unsustainable in the new, harsher world. These events suggest a strong link between climate change and societal and ecological changes. But what caused the younger Drias, you may ask? Well. Various scientific hypotheses have been proposed to explain this intriguing climatic event. One theory points to a possible extraterrestrial impact, suggesting a comet or asteroid might have struck Earth, causing widespread fires and a global cooling effect. Another hypothesis proposes massive volcanic activity, which could have spewed large quantities of ash and gas into the atmosphere, blocking sunlight and thus triggering a sudden drop in temperature. Yet another theory revolves around changes in ocean circulation. It postulates that a massive influx of fresh water from melting ice sheets could have disrupted the ocean's conveyor belt, altering heat distribution and leading to a sharp climatic shift. While each of these theories presents compelling arguments, none has been definitively proven. Though there is no consensus, these theories offer intriguing explanations for this dramatic climatic event. Evidence from Greenland ice cores provides valuable insights into the Younger Dryas. These ice cores, like frozen time machines, contain layers of snowfall that have compacted into ice over millennia. By analyzing these layers, scientists can reconstruct the climate of the past, much like how rings in a tree tell its age. And what do these Greenland ice cores tell us about the Younger Dryas? They reveal a sudden, drastic drop in temperature aligning perfectly with the time frame of this climatic event. This evidence corroborates other geological data, painting a chilling picture of a world rapidly plunged into a deep freeze. The ice cores also hint at increased dust levels, suggesting vast environmental changes. 
These ice cores serve as a frozen time capsule, offering a glimpse into our planet's climatic past. The Younger Dryas had a profound impact on human history. As the world fell into a deep freeze, people were pushed to adapt, innovate and migrate. The chill winds of this period may have swept our ancestors across the globe, fostering diverse cultures and societies. Some archaeologists suggest that the harsh conditions of the Younger Dryas could have spurred the development of agriculture, as nomadic hunter-gatherers sought stable food sources amidst the scarcity. From the fertile crescent to the river valleys of China, the seeds of civilization might have been sown in the cold, hard ground of this climatic upheaval. The Younger Dryas, it seems, left its mark not just on the planet, but also on the course of human history. Recent discoveries continue to shed light on the Younger Dryas. A prime example is the detection of microscopic diamonds in sediment layers. These nano-sized gems are indicative of a high-energy, high-temperature event, hinting at the possible extraterrestrial impact that might have triggered the Younger Dryas. Another significant development is the unearthing of ancient plant remains in lake sediments, which offers a detailed snapshot of the abrupt vegetation changes during this period. Moreover, the discovery of the Hiawatha Crater in Greenland has stirred up discussions about its potential role in the onset of this climatic event. These findings emphasize the continued relevance and intrigue of this ancient climatic event. Yet the Younger Dryas is not without its controversies. Some scientists question the theory of an extraterrestrial impact as the trigger, citing a lack of consistent evidence across various sites. Others debate the role of ocean circulation changes, arguing for more nuanced factors at play. The extinction of megafauna and the decline of the Clovis culture, too, are areas of intense debate. Did the cold snap of the Younger Dryas directly cause these events, or were they merely coincidental? The answers are still shrouded in the mists of prehistory. Each new discovery or piece of evidence adds another layer of complexity to our understanding. These debates highlight the evolving nature of scientific understanding and the ongoing quest for knowledge. Studying the Younger Dryas can offer valuable lessons for today. This period of abrupt climate change throws light on how our planet's climate systems can rapidly shift, altering ecosystems and human civilizations. By understanding the triggers and consequences of the Younger Dryas, we can better comprehend the complexities of contemporary climate change. This knowledge underscores the urgency of addressing today's escalating environmental issues. It also illustrates the potential ramifications of inaction, from drastic changes in global temperatures to the collapse of ecosystems. The Younger Dryas serves as a stark reminder that our planet's climate is not static, but dynamic and susceptible to dramatic fluctuations. The past, it seems, holds crucial keys to understanding our present and future. So, what have we learned about the Younger Dryas? We've journeyed through time, uncovering the geological evidence of this climatic event and the abrupt shifts it brought to our planet. We've seen its potential impact on the Clovis culture, the extinction of megafauna, and even the courses of human migration and civilization. We've considered theories from extraterrestrial impacts to ocean circulation changes and examined the invaluable data from Greenland ice cores. The Younger Dryas, with its intriguing complexities, serves as a stark reminder of the potential for sudden climatic shifts. As we delve deeper into this captivating period, the importance of ongoing research cannot be overstated. The mysteries of the Younger Dryas continue to captivate scientists, promising more discoveries in the future. Now we'd love to hear your thoughts on the Younger Dryas. This climatic event, shrouded in mystery, has intrigued scientists and history enthusiasts alike. What are your thoughts on the abrupt climate changes that occurred during this period and the impact they had on early human societies and ecosystems? Do you lean towards any of the scientific hypotheses explaining the cause of the Younger Dryas? Or perhaps you have your own theories that you'd like to share? Do you think the Younger Dryas offers valuable lessons for understanding contemporary climate change? Or maybe you've stumbled upon an interesting piece of research or a recent discovery related to the Younger Dryas that you'd like to share with us. Whatever your thoughts, questions or opinions might be, feel free to share them in the comments section. Your engagement enriches our understanding and keeps the conversation going.
Thank you for joining us on this journey through time. We've trekked through the icy landscapes of the Younger Dryas, delved into the mysteries of our planet's past, and pondered the implications for our future. If you've enjoyed this expedition, make sure to hit that subscribe button. We've got plenty more historical explorations on the horizon. Don't forget to subscribe and join us as we continue to explore the fascinating world of Earth's climatic history. Until next time...